Well, the month of November is National Family Literacy Month, and it's a great opportunity to read together as a family. But reading skills in children have actually stalled during the pandemic, and a North Carolina author hopes to be part of the solution with a fun and exciting new book. And I have one of her books here with me. I'd like to welcome Joy Reeser now. She is the author of the new children's book called Designed to Shine, Read Aloud Rhymes for Any Size Heart, Volume 2. Joy, great to have you. Thank you for being with us. So let's get going here. Tell us why it's important for parents and grandparents out there to spend time reading with their children. It's so vital in development. Exactly. Oh gosh, to be with your children, you've, you're putting down your devices. Maybe they're putting down their phone, but it's presence. You are sharing P-R-E-S-E-N-C-E, -E, being with the person that you're with, with your children. And Joy, tell us about the rhymes and poetry that families can expect in your book. And books, you have two now, is that right? Right, there's volume one and volume two. I would say, Audrey, that the first book, my books are alphabetical, even my books, other books that I've written, it's a structure that works for me. So when this first one was coming, the topics, it's a topical book, 26 topics. So this mm. includes love, peace, joy, kindness, forgive, energy. And when the second volume was coming through me to bless families, it's a little untraditional of these different topics. So came frosting <laughs> for F, Aww. goofy. Um, patience, there's a rhyme on lose, but everything has a positive twist on it. So even if you took a negative topic, we're looking to work with our children of how can we work with this in a positive way. And I'm just reading a page here. I'm going to read an excerpt if I may. It's titled Joy, and I chose that because that is your name. <laughs> a feeling so high, so bold, and so deep. It's natural, normal, your birthright to keep. Meet essence of joy on a walk in the creek, then stepping on grass in tender bare feet. Great joy by yourself or with badgers nearby, with monkeys on treetops, geese streaming through sky. Add hula and sunbeams. Do not hesitate. Share it, embrace it, to joy celebrate. Just beautiful. Joy, tell me your passion, you. um, your background. Did you always want to be a children's book author? No, thank you, Audrey. This has been an evolution of my life. And I, I did write poetry as a child. And I wrote and wrote letters for the college newspaper, different ways I've always written. But I also wrote a prayer in my journals. I've, I have bins of journals. I've written every day for four, over 40 years. Wow. And I wrote, I wrote a prayer to become the joy I am. So I didn't try to write these books. It wasn't some authors plan their books. These came through me to bless where they, bl <laughs> where they bless. <laughs> Well, thank you for sharing that. And tell me lastly, before we let you go, that how can parents and families help celebrate family literacy with any book? It can be, of course, your book, but also just books that surround us in our homes and reading just all around us in normal day-to-day -day life. How can we all celebrate literacy together? That is such a beautiful question. And I would remind people that it's not just for this month, which is named National Family Literacy Month, which is beautiful. But any day that you can, play a word game with your family, write letters, read. I mean, the what we gain from reading is phenomenal, isn't it? It is. You're surely right about that. Joy, you are a joy. Thank you for joining us here on The Local Vibe. And folks at home, you can purchase both volumes of Design to Shine, Read Aloud Rhymes for any size heart. You are sure to enjoy it. It's website on your screen, joyonyourshoulders.com, or you can visit Amazon as well to find a book. Thank you for joining us, Joy. I'd like to say